What's good, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? J Daisy here with the J Daisy Gaming Channel. Here with Clone Drone in the Danger Zone. Uh, this is a early access uh, game on Steam. I believe it's probably about twenty dollars. Um, I didn't actually. I'm actually reviewing this from within the game. Um, I thought it'd be kind of a fun uh, thing to do of actually reviewing in the in the uh, game, just to kind of show you guys the. Uh, a few different things of it um it'd just be easier to do it in game as opposed to outside like we normally do so we'll uh get right into it i believe it's twenty dollars or close to that it might be a little bit more a little bit less it is in early access um they just kind of finished the story mode here um it's pretty easy to beat i think it probably takes as you can see there's only three chapters and it takes maybe um, if you do it perfectly, uh, maybe about two, three hours. It's not a very long one. It's an alright little uh, story mode. I like it. Uh, we have endless mode. We have challenges. Um, just to kind of show Georgia what we're dealing Nuber. with. Uh, we'll go into endless mode here. Um, and as you see, it's kind of a gladiator game. Hopefully. It's kind of loud, so hopefully it's not as loud on your guys' end. Uh, but yeah, it is basically a gladiatorial uh, fighter. Um, where your robots fighting with laser swords. Uh, this is endless mode, so they will just keep coming. Um, there is supposedly a end to it uh, because they, as obviously as you go on, they get harder and harder. Um, this is bronze here. There's three levels bronze here, three levels it's easy like to look silver, on bronze. gold, uh, diamond, and then titanium. I've never, I think I've seen titanium once. Can the human touch this? Um, no, not if a hammer hits him first. Yeah, what see, every time. level, it gives you the name, uh, it gives you these nice little, uh, who you are, plus what you do, age, and favorite color. Um, they really are kind of meaningless, but it's just kind of a nice little thing. Here is your upgrade tree. Um, unless you're doing challenges, you have access to all these. Uh, clone, that just gives you a basic copy of yourself, so if you die, you get another one. Armor, that's just added in. Um, it actually puts a little protective shield around you, all except your head kick pretty basic you can kick people knock them down but that also unlocks up to get up which uh gets you up obviously faster um and that gets kind of helpful in the later levels um any ones with the little lock symbols you have to do challenges to get to them um we got like stuff like block arrows i'm a big fan of that one you got bow you got hammer you got jet pack which isn't a jet pack like it pushes you forward uh it pushes you forward it doesn't like make you go flying or like kick it's a nice little one um also, you have Commentron and Analysis Bot, always giving you cheeky little comments. Um, but yeah, oh, I haven't actually seen this one. And I really like the way the the robots break when you when you slice them. Um, oh, where are those things out there? Yeah, there are uh, environmental challenges, and as you can see, um, they're kind of always adding levels. There is full. Uh, uh, Creator um, made levels, and we'll get to that here. Ah, I'm just gonna dance around this guy for a while. Um, it also offers a Twitch mode, which I've and never tried. The They're um, just sitting there. Oh, hey, they oh, are that was good. On the inside. Um, it uh, also offers a Twitch mode, which will automatically run this to your Twitch account. Because, like you see, this is a pretty nice little game. Archers Especially if you're swords. running Twitch, it never you can do your old. level up there, and then when you come down here, you can read off your ads and what have you. Um, so it offers a very nice little thing like, I like block arrows. Um, it's very nice. Uh, the clones, it's kind of nice sometimes to have them because it gives you a restart, but it's at the same time, it's a little annoying. Um, this, this is a classic level. Uh, so yeah, it offers the Twitch mode, which is nice if you are a Twitch streamer. Um, just because... You know, this is a pretty easy game to launch and get going. Um, there's no crazy load times that I've seen or anything like that. You can get in, get going, um, and go ahead and fight right away. Uh, as you can see, you can lose little chunks, so if you, it's not like an insta-death. Um, you can't even go all the way up to losing a leg or an arm and keep going. Uh, the only way that'll Hooray! impede you the is if you're using a bow level. or a hammer. Um, you can't lose Not one yet. of your arms because they can't Here use comes weapons. Spider you always start off with, in endless you mode, you always start off with the sword. It was not as good. And uh, you upgrade from there to get the hammer and the what have you. 
um, with the challenges you actually will start off with what it gives you a hammer, a bow, um, the one that I have yet to beat but I really enjoy is the stick only challenge. Ah, I'm here's the spider the bot. Robots. This Robot is the thing I was saying that silver. get up would be really nice this. for. As you can see, it blows stuff up, um, and that doesn't kill you, although it can kill you. I've died by it once. Its main goal is to knock you down, um, and then the other people will finish you off. And they're just kind of fun to fight. I, I like just knocking their legs off. I'll take care of this guy. Oh. Not See, he's firing at us. And as we go on, um, they will, the spider bots become more and more. You can die by those little red parts. I've done it once. It's just kind of fun. Stop. Ooh. Um, and as you, I don't know if I mentioned this, but as you can see, you kind of have two attacks, pretty much. You can go uphand like that, or you, if you hit A and B at the same time, you get a nice little, uh, sideways. Um, there's your Comentron, your now spot the Emperor here. of the planet you're here on, his ship, um, and your wonderful, wonderful little crowd. If we wait a second, they actually have robots that come out and clean everything. Uh, that's kind of part of the story mode. Um, you, spoiler alert, but you are, you, the humans try and get out of this gladiatorial, um, arena. We'll do one more, just so you can see. Uh, we'll grab like a hammer or something, um, just so you can see what we're kind of dealing with here. And then we'll go to the challenge modes, because those are kind of preset, um, as opposed to this being, uh, uh, that happened. Uh, we'll get jetpack, that's kind of neat to see. Um, as opposed to these, where it's random levels just thrown at you, the challenge modes will actually offer, uh, there's the same challenge over and over. Oh, they must be really trying to promote this level. Um, ow! Mother trucker! See? You can't lose a leg. Come. Aha! Jetpack! Ah! Ah! Okay, here we go. One leg Jimmy. Oh, that's a red guy. Um, as you get harder, the enemies become more and more adapt. Ooh! crushed us. Yep. So as you can see, my Not high score is 13. I have seen better. And you, the whole time you have to get drawn in that. And like I said, here's the level editor, challenge modes. Uh, like, we have the power kick mode. Uh, there's pretty much uh, four and four types of combat challenges. There's the four uh, weapon styles, uh, bow, hammer, kick, uh, sword, and, uh, then the other ones are just for trophies. Uh, they're kind of a little bit more random, it seems, um, as opposed to these ones where it's the same level over and over, so you kind of get a feel of what you need to upgrade right away, um, as far as that goes. One robot down. Many more to kick. So, yeah, but I, I really have been enjoying this game. I normally just this turn off the sound, but not because this you can, after about an hour, you've heard everything off. that the commentary have to say. Um, so you get to the point where you just listen. Um, and I've been trying to get through some of the challenge modes, so I just turn off the sound, and while I'm rewatching Doctor Who or something, I can play this in the background and try to get more. Here we go. What up? I missed. Haha. And we died. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can show off one of the creator made levels. Um, nope, nope, that's create your own. I don't want to do that. Uh, let's see here. I think it's under challenges. Yeah. So it has full, uh, um, player made levels and such, and you download them from the Steam Workshop, same as you download everything else. This is the only one I have downloaded. It's the highest made or highest subscribed one, so that's why I have it. Uh, I almost got to the end of it once. Ah! As you can see, they chose to start you off pretty high level. Uh, that's why we have lives and such. But, you know, it gets harder. Ah, jeez. Oh. Fire is really cool, because it'll actually just start burning through them. It's like poison. Or we got our big. 
Uh, I don't like the hammer so much just because it does take so long to wind up. But it can't be blocked, so some people, you know. Nice work, no man. Make sure to thank the blade bot. Yeah, for some reason the okay. person that built this Sometimes one, beauty hides uh, inside. That, the most aesthetically uh, pleasing is not always chose most efficient. To make you really, really high level when they design this, so you have a lot of uh, upgrades already done. This is what the armor looks like. Um, so yeah, the story mode is all right. I wouldn't. Uh, it's not going to be winning any full of surprises or anything like that. Uh, but it is pretty good. Uh, it, it is kind of nice. It, it pretty much. It's there pretty much to teach you the basics. Um, I wouldn't say that you're going to go back and really overplay it, um, as far as that goes, but it's, it's, you know, it's nice to have, I played through it right away when I first got the game. Oh, oh well, that's fitting. Um, so yeah, it's, it's nice, uh, if you're looking for just something to kind of stick around with, um, or something to kind of do on your Twitch, I, you can always tune into whoever's playing on their Twitch mode right here. Uh, I highly recommend it. I've been having a lot of fun with it. Um, but at least that's just my opinion. Guys, that's Clone Drone in the Danger Zone. Really long title, by the way. Uh, I don't like that. But, um, if you, I really enjoy it. Uh, but that's just my opinion. As always, we're all in this one together. I'll see you in the next one.